Yes, uh, we are with Mr. Mkoya, the head coach for the Kuka Tops. Uh, Mr. Coach, congratulations for the three points. Thank you, thank you. Uh, what a beautiful game today. Uh, completely different from the yesterday's ones. Yeah. What was the differences or the tactical plans and changes that you did uh, to come up with a strong team today to handle Shikango Chief the first defeat? Yeah, we, we knew Shikango Chiefs will play their normal game. That was the only change we made today, and it paid off. And as you can see, that Kuka um, uh, Tops is picking up points. Is there any pressure from the fans and the management onto you? The pressure will always be there. Kuka Tops is a big team, so the pressure will always be there, especially from the fans. They want to win. For them, they want to win. And we saw that when the like of nursery and the number nine when it came in the game completely uh, changed the pressure was mounting yeah. uh, what was the tactic of leaving them out and bringing them in the second half yeah we knew that the uh, uh, chiefs the back line is tired so we, we needed the fresh legs so that's why we fre fresh legs and speed as well so we, we brought in nursery and, uh, and junk for the, for the speed. So as you can see, we they could not cope with the with the with the speed. Of the uh, what is the way forward from now on? What going forward for Kuka Tops and you as the head coach? Yeah, from now on is just to keep winning. A word or two from you to the supporters and sympathizers. You know that Kukato is one of the biggest team and deserve a large followers and supporters in Rundu. Yeah, just to say thank you to the supporters for coming in numbers. In numbers. We really appreciate it. We need them for the upcoming, upcoming games. As, as they know, the first leg is very tough. We really need that behind the team. Thank you. Thank you very much, Coach, for talking to us.